All right, hey, what is going on guys? Dwayne Gibson here, and welcome to Gibson's Beard Adventures. And on my channel, you're gonna find some beard product reviews, do some beard mail and boxings down again, and I've been trying to think of some other stuff that I can throw on here for y'all. So make sure y'all hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell, drop a like on this video, and watch this little intro, and we'll get right into what I'm gonna be talking about today. All right, so I posted on my Instagram last week. I picked up a beard wash and a beard balm by Power Stick for a buck a piece at the Dollar Tree. Wanted to see if they would work. On the beard wash here, it says it's a three-in-one beard wash, and it's supposed to clean and refresh beard and moisturize dry skin with jojoba oil and vitamin E. Outside there, not too bad, not too bad. On their beard balm here, it says beard and stubble. And it's supposed to control, smooth, and style tames unruly hairs with argan oil and almond oil. All right, well, if you look at the back of these, of course, it's got the long uh, botanical names or scientific names, whatever they may be for the ingredients. And I do understand the uh, jojoba oil, vitamin E, and the sweet almond that's in there. Uh, both of these have that. Uh, the balm here does have the argan oil. I really did not care for these products, okay? They did not work out for me. Uh, the beard wash, when I used it, it felt like it, it left this, this sticky residue that I couldn't hardly get it washed out. I really didn't like that. It just did not feel good. And for the consistency of this beard wash, it it reminds me of like a, a body wash almost. All right. It's kind of got that. And when it, it, it doesn't really lather, it it suds, it's just, but it's all bubbles. It doesn't have no, no lather to it. It just, it really did not feel the best and so I'm not going to use it again, and I'm not going to recommend it. Um, the beard balm, I've just it, it didn't work for me. Okay, I, I put it in, and my beard didn't feel soft. Uh, I had hairs that started sprouting out here, there, and everywhere, and it, it just it didn't feel good in my beard. Uh, I used it a few times. Left it in there, and it just, it wasn't working for me. Uh, the consistency of it here is white, kind of like a lotion. It's like a really wet lotion. Um, you can tell it, it would not have any, uh, any hold whatsoever for styling. Uh. It's just really, it's just a real, real wet product. It really is. So yeah, it, it's a definite no for me on the Beard Balm. As I said, it doesn't, it doesn't control, it doesn't smooth, and it doesn't style. Um, the feel is, is no good for me. It just, it just did not feel the best. So definitely for Power Stick on these $2 products, I cannot recommend them. It did not work for me, and I'm not going to use something that's not going to work. Um, go ahead and tell you on the the scents. Uh, basically, if you've ever used any of their deodorants, you know they kind of smell almost sort of similar. That's basically what these smell like too. So I would say no to the Power Stick uh, Shave and Skin Care. They do have like a few more products in this line. I've got a couple back there. It's in the same type of containers. It's for it's a shave gel and an aftershave, which after using these on my beard, I'm probably not going to use on my skin. So uh, definitely no for me. Like on this video if you want to. So until next time, y'all, have a good one. 
Live every day as an adventure.